Now see here, this is the question which, uh, which is based on the Young's modulus. See here, this is a suspension point and a steel wire is here of 1.5 meter length which is connected to a block of mass 4 kg. And now another wire of brass of 1 meter length is connected here with the 6 kg weight. Now see here in this case you are given the diameter of the wires both these wires is 0 0.25 centimeter and Young's modulus of the steel wire is 2 into 10 raised to power 11 Pascal. Young's modulus of this brass wire is this is 0 0.9 into 10 raised to power 11 Pascal and you have to calculate delta LS and delta LB. It means you have to calculate elongation in the steel wire and in the brass wire. So, you know the formula for the Young's modulus y is equal to mg l divided by here pi r square delta l that is increase in length l. We have done this formula. So, we can use this we need just here delta l for the steel. So, we can write this is increase in the length of the steel wire is equal to for this steel wire this and this both weights are acting. So, we can write here 6 plus 4 that is 10 into g we can write here 10 meter. So, I have taken here the g is equal to 10 meter per second square. So, here l is 1.5 meter divided by pi is here 22 by 7 into in place of our radius we can write half of the diameter. So, that will be here 0 0.25 into 10 raised to power minus 2 I have converted into meter. So, this is d square upon 4. So, 4 will be coming up here. Now, into we can take here now y will be coming this side here. So, that is Young's modulus of the steel that is 2 into 10 raised to power 11. So, now you can solve this equation. So, this is 10 into 10 that is your 100 and 1.5 7 will also be going up and multiplied by 4 and you square this and multiply by this. When you solve this whole things you will be getting 1.5 into 10 raised to power minus 4 meter. So, while calculating this value I have converted everything in the SI unit and then we have calculated elongation in the steel wire. Similarly, we can calculate elongation in the brass wire and that can be done here. For the brass wire, we can just write this formula delta that is increase in the brass wire is equal to m into g into l divided by pi r square into this is Young's modulus of the brass wire. So, we can write here for this brass wire the load is only 6. So, we can write 6 into 10 into L for this is 1 upon 22 by 7 multiplied R can be written here again d by 2. So, that will be here 0 0.25 into 10 raised to power minus 2 square and the 4 will be coming up and Young's modulus of the this brass wire is given to you this. So, you can write here 0 0.91 into 10 raised to power 11. If you put all uh, you have put already these values and just you calculate all these values. When you calculate all these values you will be getting approximately 1.3 into 10 raised to power minus 4 meter. So, this calculation can be done it is very simple here. So, this is the question which is ba uh, based on the Young's modulus.